Now, Camille, you posted a photo recently. This is you and your wife with the actor Tom Skerritt. That's right. Now, this... Very... You said this was a huge moment for you. Why? Be well, you could see that's the smile I do when I'm trying to not cry. And that's... Right. <laughs> that's what's happening right there. So, um, I love him from Alien, obviously. I mean, yeah. and a ton of great stuff. But for some reason, in Pakistan, the show Picket Fences was really, really huge. Right. It was big. So when I was first moving to America, I would, like, make Picket Fences references all the time <laughs> for, for, like, years and years. And then I was making them to my eventual wife, Emily, and she was like, hey, just so you know, people don't really know that show here. <laughs> And then when she first met my family, they were all making Picket Fences references, and she's like, what is up with you people? <laughs> so we thought it was this huge show there, but he's the lead of that show. So when I, I met him just like three or four days ago, I was like, hey, um, Picket Fences is huge in Pakistan. And he was like, well, I've never seen any of that money. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I gave him 20 bucks. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> Riz, you, we, we both grew up in England. What American shows w were you into when you were growing up? Um, I was big into MacGyver. Yeah? Yeah, big into MacGyver, because it taught me all these kind of ridiculous tricks that don't actually work in, in yes. real life. But I, I found that out the hard way. By the way, if you look like you and you're trying to MacGyver some stuff, <laughs> not good. <laughs> <laughs> if you're, like, trying to it's put true. together devices, <laughs> yeah. it's not, like, for us, you know what I mean? <laughs> I know, I, I didn't take it that far. Yeah, actually, okay. yeah. But the, um, yeah. But I shouldn't be, I feel like I should be sat next to him right now. It's going to sit over there. No, I'm gonna get in trouble. Oh my God, dude. This looks like a <laughs> panel on colonialism, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> like, All right, now it's our turn to speak. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, swap seats, swap <laughs> seats with him. Yeah, <laughs> swap seats. <laughs> yeah, well, I kind of would like try and lock myself in my own room and see if I could get, get you know, find my way out. Yeah. I couldn't. You'd lock yourself in your own room? Yeah, because you know he used to do that thing of like, okay, lock me in from the outside. Say so to my brother, lock me in from the outside. Oh. And I'll, I'll find my way out. Right. And it didn't, yeah, it didn't. <laughs> yeah. And that's how you learned to rap. Yeah, Sitting exactly. in a room on your it's own. Just locked in there for ages.